Hello guys! Welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be doing an unboxing and also I will be trying out these products that I will be unboxing right now. These are from my recent haul from Shopee and from Watson's. So, I'm really excited to open this up or to unbox these um, products right here and also excited to try them out for the first time. So, I will be telling you guys also my first impressions in regards to these products. So, yeah, but before we start, gusto ko lang talaga i-mention itong si Fresh Skin Lab na Facial Mist. This is the Collagen plus Hyaluronic Acid. This is not sponsored, guys, pero super ganda nito, guys. Bago ko lang to nakuha, I think one week pa lang ata to sa akin or more than a week. Pero ganito na yung nabawasan niya kasi super love ko siya. Lagi ko siyang ginagamit. Lagi akong nagsispray ng spray sa aking skin or sa aking face. So yeah, and then may SPF 50 na siya. Super convenient kasi talaga guys. And then it gives moisture to my skin um, in the middle of the day. Kung nagta-touch up ako, I just pat my oil and then spray ko to. Super refreshing and then at the same time, I retouch my SPF. So super ganda nito guys and super bango niya. So I highly recommend this. So baka naman fresh skin lab. <laughs> Ang feeling ko naman. Anyways, let's get started sa unboxing. So, first I'm gonna show you what I got from Watson's. Kanina ko lang siya nakuha guys kasi I have been looking for a lip gloss. I don't own any lip gloss guys. So, I was looking for a lip gloss kasi ba yun yung parang um, uso ngayon sa mga fresh fresh na makeup or yung mga no makeup makeup look. Yung medyo glossy or juicy yung lips. So, I was looking for a lip gloss nga. And, gusto ko yung medyo affordable lang siya kasi I, I don't wanna splurge so much na on makeup. Um, ngayon na lang nga ako ulit gumastos sa makeup, guys. I only got two things from Watson. So, this is the plastic right here. So, I got a lip gloss from Careline. I'm excited to try this out. This is their Careline Stain Gloss. Hindi ko alam bakit stain. Maybe because it will stain your lips. Parang magic lipstick ata to. I'm not really sure. I got this for 125 pesos. So sabi dito, grab your own care line stain gloss for a non-sticky magic lip gloss that changes color upon applying to your lips. So, meaning magsi-change yung color niya. I hope di siya ganun katingkad kasi I'm planning to layer this sa mga lip, um, lip, yung mga lip tint. Yun, mga lip tint. Kasi mahilig ako mag lip tint. So, Gusto ko sanang patungan yung lip gloss all over the lip tint para magmukhang juicy yung lips. So, tingnan natin kung okay lang siya patungan sa lip tint. And then, yung next na kinuha ko sa Watsons is also from Careline. Ito, matagal na to na collection na lumabas. Yung from Blythe. Dito kasi sa Watsons sa Zamboanga, kung ano yung mga bagong release sa Manila hindi mo siya kaagad makita dito sa mga Watson. So, parang may delay when it comes to new products or stocking up sa mga bagong products nila. So, ngayon ko lang to nakita sa Watson, sa Careline, yung ano nila, yung Starlight Eyes nila, yung Glitter Eyeshadow. So, I got one. I got the shade 201 or Linux or Lynx, Lynx. I'm not sure. So, basta yung medyo beige siya. Open lang natin, guys. So, ito siya. Swatch natin. For sure, nakita nyo na to. Hmm. ba yung kanina yung pag-swatch ko? First time ko kasi guys, gumamit ng mga glitter eyeshadow. Medyo patchy siya na masyadong basak. Maka kailangan lang to i-mix. Hmm. Patchy siya guys. Tinan niya. But, we'll see pag nasa mata na siya. So, ito yung kinuha ko sa Watsons, itong dalawa. So, yung next is from Shopee. So, I have the package here. Hindi ko pa ito binuksan, guys. Super laki ng plastic. Grabe. But, kuha tayo yung scissor. So, buksan natin. So, these are from Squad Cosmetics. Nakita ko kasi to guys sa ano sa vlog ni ni Ray Hermar Hermar tama ba? Kay Ray nakuha ko doon may buhok pa kaninong buhok ata yun. Yeah. Anyways, nakita ko yung uh, minention niya na 
kaparehas, I mean, identical sa cloud paint ng Glossier. I never owned Glossier, any Glossier products kasi super, I find it super mahal. So when she mentioned na identi, I mean, she compares this to the cloud paint of Glossier. So, grinab ko kaagad. Na curious ako. And then, super affordable niya guys. As in, super affordable. Local brand at ato. Yeah, local brand. Never ko na-experience ang formulation ng Glossier. So, I will never able to to compare it with Glossier. Very well bubbled, bubble wrapped. So, I got three shades of their multi-purpose mousse cream. So, ganito yung itsura niya guys. Ang ganda ng packaging actually. And mabigat yung packaging. So, alam mong hindi siya low quality yung packaging niya. And knowing na barato lang siya guys. So, chinek ko yung price niya. I got this for only 99 pesos each. Yung regular price niya is 149. Pero dis na-discount siya sa Shopee. So, 99 pesos each na lang siya. So, I think may promo sila parang ganun. So, super barato niya guys. And knowing na ganito yung quality ng packaging super worth it talaga. So, I hope the product is also worth it. So, I got the shade Blythe or Blith Sunny and Gleeful. So, ito yung mga pinili kong shades na babagay sa sa Morena. Isa swatch ko guys para sa inyo. So, this is Blythe. Mmm, mabango! Amoy ano, amoy icing, parang ganun, or frosting. And ang ganda ng application niya guys, tinan niya. May ano siya, halo dyan sa gitna. So this is the shade Blythe, or Blith. So, tingnan natin kung ano siya, yung blendability niya. Ay, ang ganda ng formula guys. Super nice. And ang ganda ng texture niya. Parang siyang may pagka a little silikone siya. A little lang, but still creamy. And also, parang may pagka-matte siya, yung feel. Pero glossy siya when it comes to the hand. So, nakikita pa rin yung skin mo underneath. Super nice. Na-excite tuloy ako, guys! So, itong next shade is Sunny. This is parang terracotta. So, nakikita ko sa bottle. Same amoy. Dito natin ilagay. Super pigmented. Ito parang coral na parang pinkish. Hindi pala siya terracotta. OMG! Ang ganda guys! Super ganda! Squad! Anong ginawa niya dito? Super ganda. Mamaya itatest natin ito sa, sa face natin. And then last is Gleeful. This is parang darker siya ng ano, Blythe or Blythe. These shades will look really nice sa mga morenas talaga. So, this is Gleeful. Nice din. Super light lang nito. Pero I think this will also look good on on the skin, on the face. So, that's for the multi-purpose um, mousse cream. So, last I got from Squad Cosmetics is their eyeshadow palette. Kasi parang malami akong narinig good things about this palette. So, I got their Peach Squad eyeshadow palette. This is how it looks like. Malaki siya guys, in fairness. Ganyan. And then, malalaki yung mga, ano tawag dyan, yung mga pots niya. Pots ba tawag dyan? Super laki niya. Dalo ko maliit lang siya. So, I will be trying this also on my eyes. Medyo excited na ako guys to try this on. Kasi ba diba guys, uso talaga ngayon yung mga peach look, uh, peach makeup look. Pero yung parang skin-like lang yung dating niya. Very natural, very glowing. So, bet ko yung mga makeup na yan. Super inspired ako ngayon guys sa makeup style ni Michelle Fan. As in super. And also, Anne Curtis na very natural lang yung dating. Swatch nga natin. Wala ba tong shade names? Wala siyang shade names, guys. So, try natin iswatch yung mga ibang shades. So, try natin tong mga, itong mga ganito. Hmm. It's, it feels 
dry, but it feels nice at the same time. Oh, super pigmented. I got this pala for 199 pesos. Super worth it na siya guys. And you get um, 3, 6, 9 shades already and very wearable siya for everyday. And sa mga uso ngayon na peachy look. Very nice. Try natin yung shimmer. Itong gold na shimmer. Hmm. Ito medyo soft to, to the touch. Kita nyo ba? Or hindi lang siya pigment? Ayun. Pero medyo dry yung shimmer. Pero yung matte, guys. Grabe. Ito isa. Mmm. Super nice. Plus. Yung super pigmented talaga yung kanina na... na Swinatch ko. Ito. Super pigmented nito. Anyways, conceal ko lang yung eyes ko and some parts of my face. And then we will be trying these products on our face. So, yeah, I'll be back. So, naglagay na ako ng concealer and then nagkilay na din ako. So, we will proceed now sa ating blush. So, I'm deciding what to wear. I think yung Gleeful na lang suguro. Yung, try natin yung Gleeful, guys. Sa ating cheek. Super blendable niya, guys. And then it leaves a parang shine. Parang a little shine lang. Para at least mukhang healthy yung cheeks niyo. I'll add more. Mm, super nice. Very natural lang, guys. A little goes a long way. Niyo na kailangan idip alit sa ano. Sorry guys, kung meron ako parang nunal jan. Actually, kala ko blackhead siya or whitehead. Pinisa ako talaga ah, kagabi. Walang yung babas until nasugata na yung cheeks ko. Do not do that. Do not. Wag yung kung gayahin guys, kasi grabe, super harsh ko sa akin yung skin pa minsan. So kung minensya ni Ray, her, her mar na. Very similar to cloud paint siya. So, meaning, ganito pala yung texture ng cloud paint. Guys, pinapakapal ko siya. Kasi para makita niyo sa camera. Kasi parang nawa-wash off ng lights. Yung ano, try natin i-off to. Kung nakikita niyo. Ayan. This is without the beauty light. Kasi nawa-wash off kasi. Ha, super in love ako. So, this is in the shade um, Gleeful. Squad, you did something dito sa product na to. Super galing. Super nice. I highly recommend and super affordable guys. Ngayon kung pinapanood nyo tong video na to, kung may 99 pesos pa sa Shopee, sinasabi ko na sa inyo, bilhin nyo na kasi super worth it. Super worth the money. Kahit 149 pesos pa yan. Kasi yung regular price niya is 149 pesos. Ngayon naka-sale siya at this moment sa Shopee. Kahit 149 pesos yan, i-grab nyo na. Super worth it nito. Masasabi ko, hashtag Ray Hermar made me buy this. So, yeah. So, next I will be putting on um, eyeshadow. Itatry natin tong mga eyeshadow. So, I don't think I will be able to use all of the shades. Kasi gusto ko very natural look lang na parang may flash of color lang siya. First shade, I will be using this one. Hindi siya powdery, guys. Sorry, no? Yung plastic sa baba. Sorry. Morena ako, guys. And I have also dark lids. Although, nag-concealer naman ako. Pero paminsan, nag-pick through pa rin yung dark circles ng mata ko. Pero nag-show yung color sa lids ko. Usually, mga ganito ka-light na shade. Paminsan, hindi nag-show up sa aking lids. But ito, nag-show up siya, guys. Super nice. So, maglagay tayo ng konting shimmer ito, guys. Parang pinkish na parang may gold flecks or shimmer. Lagay lang natin siya sa gitna. I'm just using the shimmer. Oh my gosh, hindi siya powdery, guys. Super amazed ako. So, lalagay lang natin ito sa gitna. Na meron na siyang konting shimmer. And the light will hit that area. Ang ganda niya! Hindi ako makapaniwala na 199 pesos lang tong palette na to. And super laki ng pan niya. Super tagal mo tong mauubos, as in. And yung mga peachy shades, bangi na bagay to sa mga morena. And then, I don't know if I will put under the eyes. I mean, lower lash line. So, we'll maglagay tayo. I will be using this shade. Mix na lang natin to. Itong dalawa. Mabalance lang yung 
color size. So, next, lagay natin yung Kai Blythe Cosmetics. Hindi ko lang alam if this will go with this look, but we will see. I don't know if this will go with this look, pero tingnan natin. Natatakot ako guys kasi super basa niya. Um, sige, try natin i-direct sa, sa eyes. Oh my gosh, super basa niya. Gusto ko i-spread. Oh no! Super basa niya guys. Na galaw niya yung eyeshadow base ko underneath. Nakita yung skin ko. This is not nice at all. Sinira ko lang yung makeup look ko. Ano ba natin ayos ito? Tinodo ko na lang guys. Oh my gosh! Super basa niya. Super patchy niya. No, 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 no. Sinira mo look ko. Kita niyo ba guys how patchy it is? Kaka-fallouts na. Blythe! Bakit ganito? This is the most that I can do with this shadow. Sinira niya na yung base ko underneath ko na ay shadow. So, hi! Todo na lang natin to. Kasi nandyan na. Pantayan na lang natin. Super basa niya kasi, guys. Um, Caroline, you really need to improve this formula. Maganda sana yung shade. Super wet lang kasi niya. Anyways, let's stop. Kasi ayaw ko nang sirain pa yung aking look. Hanggang dyan na lang tayo. Let's proceed to the lips. So, for lips, first I will use, again, yung multi-purpose um, mousse cream ng Squad. So, I will be using the shade Sunny. So, tina natin yung itsura niya pag nasa lips na siya. Nice din siya sa lips guys. Parang blotted lang ang dating niya. And matte siya sa lips. Pero hindi siya drying. So, papatungan natin ng lip gloss. Yung binili ko from Caroline. So, dito ako medyo kinakaban kasi nagsi-change yung kulay na. So, baka magsi-change tong kulay na to. Mabango din siya. In fairness. Nakita na to guys. Yung parang pink dyan sa bottle. Baka ganito yung kulay niya. Oh my gosh. Okay, so try natin. fairness, hindi siya sticky. Na-achieve natin yung juicy lips na gusto ko. Nag-change siya a little ng color. Naging a little pinkish na yung lipstick ko. But, maganda siya. In fairness. Hindi naman siya super tingkad na pink for me. So, maglalagay na ako ng mascara, guys. Then, balikan ko kayo. So, I am back and I will tell you now my thoughts in regards to the products that I tried. So, first, let's talk about the multi-purpose mousse cream, tama ba yung name, from Squad. Ito yung uunahin ko kasi super love ko to. As in, ito yung pinaka-favorite ko among all the products that I've showed you and also tried. Super nice ito, guys. So, again, I highly recommend this and if you are able to get this, um, Lazada, I think, available din and Shopee. Get it na kasi super worth the money, super worth the buy. Super ganda ng quality and it's not drying. It's really moisturizing. If you have dry skin, hindi kayo magkakaproblema. I also have dry skin on this area so okay lang siya. The shades are nice. These shades that I pick are the ones I think na babagay siya sa morena. I think other shades are more on the pink so hindi ko gusto yung mga pink. So hindi ko kinuha yun. So yeah, I really really love this product from Squad Cosmetics. You did a good job on this um, multi-purpose 
mousse cream ninyo. Again, from Squad, yung eyeshadow palette nila, yung Peach Squad eyeshadow palette. It is also nice. For 199 pesos, you get big pans already. And then, ang ganda ng shades niya actually for mga peachy, glowy look na gusto niyong i-achieve. And I think this will go a long way kasi super, uh, yun na nga, super laki ng pans and then very um, pigmented siya. It's not powdery. Meron siyang konting powder lang guys as in super konti. Pero marami pang mga palettes out there kahit yung mga mahal na super powdery siya when you dip your brush. So, this is actually really nice. I also recommend this to you if you want to buy it. It is also available at Lazada and also at Shopee. This is not sponsored, guys. I'm just sharing it with you guys. Kasi nakita ko to kay Ray Hermar. And gusto ko talaga nung itry. Kasi super na-curious ako nung sinabi talaga niya na it really reminds, especially ito, it really reminds her about the cloud paint of glossy. So, doon ako na doon ako nakuha or doon ako na napalingon, parang ganun. Squad Cosmetics, you really did a good job. Affordable pa yung mga cosmetics ninyo or yung mga item products ninyo. So, very good. I'm really happy. And then local brand siya. So, that's for Squad Cosmetics. Yung Blythe naman na Starlight Eyes ito. Super na sad ako dito. Parang masayang lang yung pera ko. I got this for 195 pesos. Ewan ko lang kasi I top this all on top of a powdered um, eyelid. So I don't know if kung gagamitin nyo siya diretsyo sa eyelids niyo kung okay lang siya. But based sa swatch ko dito, patchy din siya. So I think kahit idadiretsyo nyo siya sa eyelids niyo, magiging patchy din siya. I remember when I watched yung first impressions ng mga mga YouTubers dito sa eyeshadow, I mean Starlight Eyes. As far as I can remember sa mga napanood ko sa mga impressions nila, yun na nga, patchy nga siya. But I gave it another chance kasi baka naman na-improve nila yung formula nila. And sa pag-swatch ko nga dun sa Watsons, siguro dahil dry na yung formula sa loob. Maganda yung pag-apply niya, lalo na yung darkest shade nila. Since super pag-glide ko ng brush ganyan, super opaque yung color niya. Wala siyang patchiness. So, hindi ko in-expect na ganito siya. Super basa niya, guys. As in, super wet niya. So, I don't know if this will apply nice. Even if direct siya sa eyes. So, I don't recommend you buying this. Kasi masasayang lang yung pera nyo. So, I hope si Blythe will improve or even Caroline will improve this formula. Kasi sayang, maganda sana yung mga shades niya. So, lastly is the Caroline Stain Gloss. So far, hmm, naging pink na yung medyo pinkish na yung aking lips. Pero hindi naman siya ganun katingkad. But na-achieve naman yung parang juicy lips nyo for only 125 pesos. So, I think it's it's okay na siya, okay na siya for a lip gloss and hindi siya sticky. Ngayon yung nalalasahan ko parang parang sun, lasa ng sunblock, ewan ko lang. Ewan ko kung yung pagmix niya sa Squad Cosmetics or ito mismo yung lasa niya. Pero kung amuyin mo naman siya, mabango naman siya, guys. Oh, mabango naman siya. Amoy ano din siya, sweet, something sweet. Pero eh, hindi ko alam bakit parang lasang sunblock yung nalalasaan ko ngayon. But anyways, okay din tong Caroline na lip gloss. Alam kong may lip gloss din si Everbilena. I was looking for that kanina. Pero, hindi ko nahanap sa Watsons. So, kaya nga yung nasabi ko sa inyo na pag dito sa Zamboanga, you don't expect na makita mo kaagad kung ano yung bagong release or yung ano yung mga bago ng mga local brands na magkakaroon na din sila dito. Kasi parang may delay sa mga shipment siguro or sa pag-order or Siguro pinaprioritize yung mga nasa metro. So, yun. Kaya medyo delayed kami dito sa Zamboanga when it comes to the new products of Everbilena, of Caroline, mga ganyan. So, yeah. So, I think that's about it, guys. Actually, uh, I do like my makeup look except for this one. Kasi parang sinira niya na yung aking look. Naging pat patchy na yung aking eyeshadow look. But, Overall, masaya ako sa mga pinarchase ko and especially the Squad Cosmetics. Um, the hype and the promotion of the YouTubers are really um, legit and it's really, uh, tawag dyan, it's really, really good. Their products are really in good quality. 
as well as the packaging. Although yung ano, don't expect too much sa packaging ng um, eyeshadow palette. Medyo light siya and plastic. Pero 199 pesos guys, magre-reklamo ka pa ba? Yung important thing is maganda yung mga yung performance ng eyeshadows. So, I will have to play with this more. Um, of this eyeshadow and and I think I will love playing with all these shades on my eyes. So yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. I hope may nakuha kayong um, good information in this video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching and um, if you're not subscribed yet on this channel, please subscribe guys. And if you like this video, please give this a thumbs up. And don't forget to follow me on all my social medias. Everything will be linked down below. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye! God bless!